Hey there, and welcome to this quick start guide for Kai's clan. Hi, I'm Ollie, and I'll be taking you through the steps for setting up your classroom with Kai's clan. From unboxing to calibrating your mat and connecting your robots to your virtual classroom. So you've got your Kai's clan classroom pack. Whether it's the four pack or the 12 pack, getting your Kai robots ready is easy peasy. Let's now unpack the box and run through what's included. At the top of the pack, you'll find your quick start guide, which will help you get your Kai's clan system up and running. There's also some sticker packs in there, which will go on the top of your robots later on for the robot tracking. Underneath, we've got four Kai robots. We've also got a Kai bit pack. The bit pack includes a variety of sensors and attachments you can use with your robots. In this bag, we have a four-way micro USB charging cable to keep your new Kai's Clan buddies nice and energized. There's also an infrared remote, which can be used with your robots for some creative coding. Here we have a pack of Kai's coding cards. This is a great way to get started if you haven't done much coding before. And finally, we've got this tripod mount. This goes on top of the tripod and holds Kai's eye in place. Underneath here, you'll find your tripod and your adventure mat. The adventure mat's where all the fun happens. We can roll this out and do some coding. The tripod's just in this little sleeve here in the side. So this holds Kai's eye up in the sky so that he can view the mats and track the robots. This tripod just folds out nice and easy. And finally, in the box, there's a few little boxes with some spare parts and some coding uh, bit cables. Today, we'll be using the Rescue Run AR VR adventure mat that comes with the Kai's Clan Start Pack. We've also got the Mars Discovery, Automated Warehouse, and Smart City AR VR mats with more to come. Now let's get calibrating. First things first, you'll need an iPhone or an Android phone, and you'll also need to download the Kai's Eye app for tracking the robots. Just search for Kai's Eye in the Apple App Store or the Google Play Store. I've also put links in the description below. Now, I hope you haven't thrown your packaging out just yet, because we'll still need to scan the serial barcode located on the outside of the box. But no drama if you don't have the box, because the serial barcode is also included on the quick start guide. Let's roll the mat out and lay it on the floor where you have enough space to move around it. For the next step, we'll only need to do it once, and that's the mat calibration. Head over to tracker mode and stand in front of the mat, facing the side with the Kai's logo on it. Make sure when you're in tracker mode, you can see the entirety of the mat. Then we move in clockwise around the mat, scanning the left side, the top, and then the right to complete the calibration. Well done. Now hop onto your computer and access the Kai's cloud from your browser so that we can create a classroom session. I'll leave the link below. We'll be taken to the login page. Because it's our first time using this, we'll need to register a teacher account. An email will be sent to you with the confirmation link. Click on the link to finalize the registration. If you can't find it, check your spam folder. Click create a classroom and we'll give it a name. Go back to your smartphone and to the Kaizai app and click QR scan again. Scan the classroom QR code that you've just generated. Awesome! Now we're ready to bring out the stars of the show. Let's attach a QR marker sticker to the robot roof rack and also attach a corresponding number sticker to the back of the robot. Make sure to match the back stickers with the number on the QR marker. Remove the battery protection sleeve, then switch the robot on. Your robots are ready to run out of the box. No prior charging is required. 
On the back here, you can see the battery charge level. Four bars is a full charge and makes for a happy robot. To pair the robots, hold your phone up to each of the robots until they show up on the app. You'll notice that each robot will start blinking in different colours, and this corresponds to the ones in the app. Match them up together and assign the number that's on the QR marker sticker we put on earlier. The grippers will close once the pairing is completed. We're almost done. Just one final thing and we'll be ready to code with Kai. Grab the tripod and mount the phone and place it so that the camera is pointing at the mat. Go into the robot tracker mode and adjust the tripod until the camera captures the entire mat. Make sure nothing is placed on the mat that would cover the mat's QR markers along the border. Kai's eye's computer vision needs to be able to see them so that it can track the positions of the robots and the mat. If the tripod has been bumped out of place, you might need to realign it. Once that's done, we can put the Kai robots onto the mat and we're good to go. Awesome, well done. From here on, we're ready to get coding. That's it for now. Be sure to check out our other videos and don't forget to hit that like and subscribe button. And if you don't want to miss any new videos, make sure you turn on notifications by tapping that bell icon. Thanks for watching. That's it from me and a big kite five for you.